Hey guys, JD here from MySlumberYard.com. Hopefully you're doing well. In today's video, we're talking Ortho Mattress. So Ortho, the brand, recently reached out to us and sent us over a few of their mattresses to try out, all of which we really enjoyed. But one that we particularly gravitated towards was the Elgin 2 Pillow Top. And we're gonna tell you everything that you need to know about this bed before you buy it in today's video. So stick around because today we're gonna talk about the policies this bed is backed by, then we're gonna delve into its overall design and construction, talk about how that in turn affects its feel, firmness, profile, stuff of that nature. At the end, we're gonna talk about the bed's pricing, and at the very end, I'll even try to sum things up with a nice final verdict for you, so stick around. Now, if you happen to get something out of this video, we'd appreciate it if you dropped a like on this video and considered subscribing for so much more. And if you need more information about this particular mattress, maybe I happen to miss something in today's review, check in the description box. We should have some helpful stuff linked down there for you. But now, let's talk ortho. Okay, so for starters, let's talk about the types of policies that you should be backed by should you decide to go the route of the Elgin 2 pillow top from Ortho Mattress. Now, for the record, I do wanna clarify right up top here that we did receive this bed for free from the brand to review, so we could test it out over here at the Slumberyard and tell you guys all about it. And a little bit about Ortho Mattress as a brand, they're based out of Southern California and they started as a brick and mortar shop, so they actually have showrooms down there that you can go to and test out their mattresses. But since they're transitioning into the online space, these policies might not apply to each and every single one of their mattresses, more so for this specific one. And the policies you get on this bed may heavily depend on where you live. It could be much different for you if you do live outside of the state of California, so keep that in mind. But for starters, you should be getting completely free bed in a box shipping, a 100 night trial period, so you can test the bed out at home for three months risk-free before you're officially stuck with it. You do have free returns within that trial window, but if you decide to keep the bed, you should be backed by a standard 10 year warranty. And again, that policy information may differ from state to state, but that's just the baseline here. Enough about the policies though, let's talk about the actual design and makeup of this mattress and delve into its real construction elements. So on the bottom, it starts off with a support layer of pocketed coils, and this is the primary support system for the mattress. And because it uses those coils, it's gonna naturally be able to handle and withstand all body types right off the bat, including much heavier people. If you didn't know, pocketed coils are basically individually siloed springs that go a long way in providing heavier folks with a bit more nightly support than your average all foam mattress. And the coils on the Ortho 2 are actually encased in a foam board so that provides some solid edge support to the bed. More on that a bit later here. Above those coils, you've got the bed's main comfort layers called Orthoplex, and these are basically more responsive comfort foams. I believe one's a poly foam, one's a latex foam. And those two foams actually have a little bit of a zone support feature, which again, I'll talk about later on in this video. Now, topping everything off is a pretty nice tensile blend cover with some extra comfort elements quilted in, and I believe there's a little bit of memory foam in there as well. And the cover of this mattress is kind of cool to the touch, which could contribute to its overall performance and temperature regulation. But again, we'll talk about that stuff in a little bit here. Let's talk about this bed's real feel. Well, if you hop on this bed, I think you're gonna find that it has a really accommodating pillow top feel that practically anyone out there could get down with. To us, it just feels like a nice hotel bed or something that a lot of sleepers are already probably familiar with. The bed strikes a really nice balance of overall support and comfort that you get from it. And another really accommodating thing about this mattress is also its firmness level. So the Elgin 2 pillow top, you can get different versions of this bed on their website but the version we have is right around a proper medium on our scale, so it should be a viable option for pretty much all sleeper types right off the bat, backside, stomach, and combination. Firmness is a pretty subjective thing though. It may come down to your body type or how firm or soft you innately feel beds to be. So if you wanna check out another mattress from Ortho as a brand, they offer a slew of others. We'll try to link them down below in the description or at least more information on them. Now let's talk couples. If you intend on sharing this bed with your partner, what do you gotta know? And it mainly comes down to edge support, motion isolation, and temperature regulation. So edge support is basically how sturdy the perimeter edges of a mattress are under pressure. If you sleep pretty close to them at night, you don't really wanna roll off. And on the Elgin 2 pillow top, it's pretty dang sturdy because of that foam encased border along those coils. So I think if you sleep close to the edges of this mattress, you're not really gonna fall off anytime soon. Motion isolation, on the other hand, refers to how well a bed absorbs cross mattress movement. If you sleep with a particularly light sleeper who's easily jostled awake by your movement, you wanna see how well the bed deadens your movement to not wake them up 
up, obviously. And on the Elgin 2 with the pillow top, it's pretty much average. We'd say it's on par with a lot of other responsive pillow top options out there. It's not gonna be as actively deadening as a more dense memory foam option, like a Tempur-Pedic mattress, for instance, but still pretty good in this regard. Now, in terms of temperature regulation, I did mention that the cover on this bed is slightly cool to the touch, which may benefit most hot sleepers out there, but we would say it's pretty much a temperature neutral sleeping bed, like a lot of others within the online space. We don't think it's excessively gonna warm up on you or really actively cool you, but you know, there are some beds within the online space that are really good active cooling options. We'll try to link them down below in the description box, but you know, this bed's pretty much neutral. One fun fact about this bed that I kind of mentioned earlier is its zone support design. So the transitional layers of foam within this bed, they're actually divided into seven separate zones to help keep your back more properly aligned at night. Having a bed with a zone support feature is always nice to have. It's especially beneficial for those who suffer from chronic back pain. You know, if you're sleeping on a mattress that kind of bows in the middle, that could be really bad for your back. This mattress shouldn't, you know, bother you in that regard. It should help to keep your back properly aligned on a nightly basis. Now let's talk about pricing. How much are you gonna be shelling out for the Elgin 2 with a pillow top when all is said and done? Keep in mind, pricing within the online space fluctuates, and this is as of when I'm recording this video, but right now you can expect to pay around the $15, $50 mark for the queen size. We'll try to link any sorts of discounts that we can find with Ortho Mattress, and specifically with the Elgin 2 pillow top down below in the description box, we should be able to save you a little bit of money on this option, but that's pretty much gonna sum it up for this video. We're new to Ortho Mattress, but we were pleased to see kind of the quality in the beds that they sent us. And you know, we really like the Elgin 2, but let's give you a real final verdict on it. Over here, we'd say look into this bed if you want a supportive hybrid mattress with a pillow top feel that's right around a medium. You like the sound of that zone support design in its construction. And you also wanna maybe try this bed out in a store before you buy it online. I know that's, you know, a big ticket item for a lot of folks out there who are new to buying an online mattress, but let us know what you guys think. Would you try out the Elgin 2 pillow top for yourself? Or have you had any experience with this bed prior? Write down below in the comments. We'd love to know your thoughts. If you need any more information about it, hit the description box. There should be tons of helpful resources linked down there for you to peruse. And like this video and subscribe to the channel if you got something out of this one. But that's pretty much gonna do it for today's video. Hopefully you're doing well out there. Again, my name's JD. Sleep right, sleep tight. We'll see you next time. Subscribe.